Hello, welcome back to Cracks in the Glass. We've just broken into this beautiful pagan themed shop here. Stolen this thing that the keepers wanted me to steal. And now I'm trying to decide whether to go back the way I came over to Mr. Archer's roof there. Or try exploring the ground level of the park. No. Let's give the ground level a go. Probably a terrible idea. Hmm? What was that? Just rats again. <laughs> terrible idea. Let's get back up. Nothing. There seems to be nothing down there on ground level. <laughs> Over here, at least we can look forward to having this guy get off and get annoyed. Now, I haven't been in that window. I came out of that one. I know somewhere back there, and I can't remember where. I did point it out last episode. There was another open window accessible from a rooftop that I thought, oh, I want to come back to that, and never did. That is the way of life. Oh, what is this machinery? Oh, sorcery. And it's very noisy, whatever it is. There's a bag of box of hammers. Oops. Ugh. There's many guards around, so let's leave the light on so I can see what I'm doing better. Right, so here we have all kinds of equipment, which I don't need, so I can't pick up. I imagine all the stuff I could manufacture. Empty toolbox. But there's a window. Oh! I think this is the one I talked about last episode. Yeah, because I went in there, I went in that window, and then there's an exit over there, I think. And I saw this, and I thought, oh, I need to remember to go there, and then forgot about it. Well, here I am. Where's my compass? Uh, I guess I'm trying to get northwest to Paolo's place. Which I thought I was trying to do before, but somehow didn't manage it. Yeah. Keep seeing things, it's good for your health. Oh, I guess I've not been here before. Well, if I did, I didn't look very close to the ledge. <laughs> Who's over there? More than they recognize me. Hmm. Not as exciting as I thought. Yeah, well, a new window to jump into. Oh, you know what I'm missing? <laughs> My death. It's been a while since I fell to my death. No, that's not what I'm missing. I am missing... Uh, that weird... place... with the sky underneath. The parky, sort of... where the world was all broken. I'm sure there's something more there that... Wow, more deer legs. Look at all this food. Garrett's gonna be fat as a... I know there's something really fat when he gets out of here. Now, sleeping guards are all very well. Ah, he's not gonna wake up. Let's stick to my principles of not knocking people out unnecessarily. Of course, if he does wake up, I'm gonna be uh, in trouble. Fire arrows. bright in here, but uh, yeah, I'll manage. Not 
You're making noise now. Alright, have I been here? Oh, there's someone up there, alright. Now we've got a archer coming this way. Let's get back inside and try to stay out of his way. If he's, see if he patrols this way. Does sound like it. I think I've been this way. Well, I might have been up there. Yeah, I came. I came out of that window because I dropped onto that wooden thing and then jumped. Across. Oh, I missed a golden candlestick. Would you look at that? How are you supposed to get that? Well, if I find my way itself up on that ledge again, I'll go take a look. But... No, George elsewhere. You know George off duty tonight. Aha. Uh -huh. What I say about finding myself on that ledge? Well, I might just be doing so. In which case, I'll take that, thank you very much. Alright, I mean I'm supposed to be going south northwest? Oh wait I don't know. So I have been here before. And some of this led to that weird place. Oh, hello. What have we got there? A rose? What? Doesn't make any sense. Well, I guess the guard is, uh, well, somebody. Maybe this guard here is. Standing, hoping his lady love will come to the window and take his rose, and they'll live happily ever after. Sorry, mate. The only one coming down this ladder is me, and I am definitely not your lady love. Oh, you don't have a purse. Nope, not a door. All oh, right, came through here. came out of this room. Yeah, I came down the dumbwaiter. Oh, and this that's the window. Oh. Alright, so is this the one place that connects to that weird area? No, that's the park again. Alright. turned about. What did I see there? That was nothing. <sighs> did I go in that window? I did not. Let's try going there. Just to make more, make things more interesting. Mm. Noise, stop! <laughs> Guess it was nothing. You're gonna be nothing. All right, so I've been in there, I think. Yeah, that's the guy asleep. All right. 
coughing in his sleep. Let's put you well out of the way. Let's check out this passage. Oh no. Oh no, we're in the sewers, look at that. <laughs> it's all going upside down again. I guess if you're gonna make a sewer, Montgomery Square, it's a good way to make it. Well, he lives just upriver from Montgomery Square. Alright, so this is on the way to Paolo's place, and I need to be quite careful here, because normally... Well... Normally you don't have to swim upside down to get through places like this. Uh, I suppose, since the name disorientation was already taken, that I uh, couldn't reasonably use it for this, but this map certainly deserves it. Well, oh, hello. I should have looked up or down or whichever way this is. <laughs> Flooded room. Oh no, the toilet overflowed. Where are we? Oh. Did it come in here? Hello. With this letter, you'll find a box. Tomorrow, you will arrange a meeting with Garrett three days from now in your inn's basement. However, you won't be there. You will also make sure that nobody except Garrett goes into that basement that day. Then you'll just forget about this little affair. You will comply. Otherwise, look in the box. A. I have a bad feeling about this. Yep. Well, we, uh found Fowler's place, but we don't know anything more about why half the town is sideways and upside down. Let alone why, uh... What? What was that noise? Bread and a flash bomb. This is Paolo's hideout, right? <laughs> Guess I'm not getting up there. And that door doesn't open. Alright, well I guess I go back to Montgomery Square, I mean... <laughs> man, if I had missed this place, if I hadn't happened to look... ...up or down or whichever way this is... ...at the right moment... Uh, I would have probably... Yeah, some weird sound issues there. Probably found it very hard to, uh, to find. Okay, that's where I came from. Let's see if there's anything else further along in these sewers. Upside down, is it? Or not? No, it's just high up. Okay. I wonder if this is the factories that we couldn't get access to. It certainly looks factory like. Machinery that I don't know what it does and can't interact with. I was going to say it's an entirely new set of streets, but it's not. I was upstairs in that building before. 
I just don't think I came to street level here. Uh, up more upside down places. I wish that's just where I was. I don't know. I can't tell. How come all the other guards? Yeah, that's Montgomery Square. That's the bridge. How come all the other guards aren't going insane? Maybe they're just not looking. It'd be interesting if there are other guards just wandering around. Upside down. No. Nobody. All right. Oh, there's the pilot's sewer. All right. There's a window here that I can get in. And this is the weird place, isn't it? Yeah. All right. Did I check this room? I did. It's Candleman. Alrighty. All I've got left to do is get back to my hideout, but, uh. Who's there? Probably easier said than done. That's right, he goes back and forth. Nice and dark in this doorway though, isn't it? Sorta. Maybe. Let's look through a bit. Hmm. <laughs> Suspicious. Nope, nothing in there. Oh great, he's coming back now. I just saw that and assumed there was going to be another secret passage I should explore. I wonder if it is possible to get into that purple tower. Maybe not. Maybe it's just there to be weird. Quiet. Is there anything in here? Apart from our archer friend. Looks like it's nothing. Yeah, there's some loot. Much too much light. There's this ledge it leads out towards this tower, but it doesn't really feel like it's meant to be out here. No sign of a secret door or anything, so yeah. I assume this is just here so you can practice falling to your death. I wonder what this looks like from underneath. Let's find out. That's what it looks like. wanted to do that again there because, uh, whoops, editing out that crash, given the state of my editing tools, it's going to be a little bit easier with uh, having a little bit more to play with. What's that on there? No, it's just the bottom of the gargoyles. Look white like some kind of mm. looty thing. But it clearly wasn't. Oh, hello, sir. Well, I guess the mansion there is the best way back towards my uh, hideout. He turns around, right? Yeah. Alright, let's go. to the ground floor, which turns out not to be the ground floor, and we'll leave it. Oh, the rats are going the other way, one of them is. Yeah, that's a rat race. Right. 
right, I think it came in here. Which was incredibly noisy, but yes, here we are at the first of the ups and down places. Now, I never actually went this way, so I'm going to do so now. Um, I didn't realize that I would find everything I needed by going the other way, but it's an interesting, fascinating courtyard. Does the switch actually work? I know I can hit it with a... Yeah, it does. Oh, that's going to make it easy to get back to my uh, hideout. Where does this take me, though? This is new. I do hear water. Oh, there's a sewer. Again. And a tunnel. Interesting. Uh, and... Roof? Oh, there's this whole section I've not been through. Come on, get on the rope. There's another crane. This one actually does have a climbable rope. <laughs> Who made that noise? It was nobody. Don't make me hit you. Alright. I don't know any regrets about that, but maybe you will. In the morning, when you wake up. That's an actual door. That looks like a... Uh, it's not a passage. Does this take me anywhere I've been before? Don't know. Doesn't look familiar. <coughs> I see some flowers. Door that doesn't open. Ah, oh, no loot that I can see. Alright. <laughs> so what's this window? See, I could be going back to my hideout, but... You know. Uh, what? Oh, it's a mask on the statue. I thought it was like had a human face. God, that's creepy anyway, that's... That's very creepy. Punish you for creepiness, I'm gonna try to destroy your banners, but it's not gonna work. More glass tools. Actual valuables apart from them, those masks. Where are we now? <laughs> Wait a second. I was just here. This is the same courtyard. It's a bloody mirror image. Oh my god. Uh. And again, here there's nothing but these, right? Oh. This door opens and... Have I been here? Oh yeah, this is where... Uh, I never came out this way. This was uh, Mr. Horner Quintus's room house. Okay. But now I'm very confused about the ground level because... Oh dear. I guess I'm at the ground level. I guess I'll explore it. I wasn't. I was trying to jump over there, but, you know. Nah. You're imagining it. There's a cellar. Now. Cellar, another doorway. Whole passageway. Very drunk civilian. Hang on, I've never been here? This is where I just... That's uh, the square. I didn't think I'd been there. I certainly haven't been in here, but maybe that's a different way out of the square, because I'm kind of, what, 
Eastern Square. Uh, I think it came from the north to the square. I don't remember. Alright, let's wait for this guy to go. down here. It's not this side. Wait, it's back upstairs. Let's try the other hallway. Nothing, nothing. There is an open window that leads somewhere suspiciously weird. Oh my god. What is going on? This one doesn't even have the decency to maintain a single sense of direction. Oh dear. I mean I can get down there safely but I can't get back up. There's even a guy just walking back and forth, completely uh, blase about the whole thing. This is ridiculous. What's gone wrong with Garrett's head? Oh. Let's wait till this guard has actually gone round. I need to follow him upstairs, I think. Looking down. Didn't hear me. There it goes. It's the stairs are made of the uh, carpet. Just because I've been here only a few months. I heard something. Oh no, 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 no. You heard nothing. Just you wait, Tapper. Just you wait. Wait, did you get confused? Right, first flash bomb used, but that'll do. Can I slash this banner, please? Nope, not a single banner works. Well, I've got the loot. Since I was accidentally noisy. Do you have anything on you? No. Yeah, none of the doors open. Well, I have no expectation that that banner will be slashable. Oh god, I was making a lot of noise and I had the door open. Like for me, the answer was nowhere nearby. He's coming back now. Right, I'm still in the mirror, mirror image one, and I haven't finished exploring the non mirror image one, but I want to come back and explore that weird place. I'll leave this door open to remind me, hopefully. Oh dear. I bet this doesn't actually lead to a cellar, right? No, it is, it's a coal cellar! I go down a cellar door and it comes out in the coal cellar, although, alright. Oh, hang on. <laughs> There's another way to the same place. Oh, there's a pirate's lair down there. Alright, it's gonna be fun. I'll get down there soon. Let me try and get through here again. There we are. Alright, so much for the mirror image. Oh, this door. Let's 
trying to keep an eye on the archer then to see if he's turning around, but uh What's this bag of spice and some rats running around. Cucumber. Right, well that looks out on some kind of building I haven't seen before. I'll leave you to it, Mr. Sleeper. Alright, now I need to follow him. Well, I need to get down there and up on the crates again. How far does he go? Does he go? No, he just turns around right away. I'll wait, wait here for him. My blackjack ready in case he decides to cut the corner, but I don't think he cuts the corner. No, he doesn't. He just goes straight up. Alright. Mm. Alright, well, that's the mirror image street, which I want to come back to, but so let's finish exploring that. The non mirror image. I like this. I hadn't actually noticed this entire room is a mirror image of itself. Nice. Oh, that must be fun to make. We need more missions that mess with your head with the geometry. It's a good look. Alright, so that's what I could see outside the sleeper's window. This, this street is not entirely mirror image, only the top of it is. Because part of it is sideways! And in fact, the part of the sideways is, in fact, the interesting sideways piece I was seeing before. So that's worth noting. This is the pirate's lair below me, which I'll look at in a minute. So yeah, could have come down there. Oops. I got stuck on the window. Slid down here without any damage and ended up here. Is this anything on this balcony? <laughs> Nope, and the door doesn't open. Is there somebody asleep in the pirate's lair? This is very neat that you can just look at the window, the water. Oh, let's stay out of light. Let's just... There's nothing there. And you can you can look at the water and easily scout scout out the place before dropping down. No, I'm hearing the sleeper in that room, okay. These bunk beds seem to be the safest place to drop down. Oh, is the whole thing underwater? What? That's back to front for a pirate's lair. I explain why well, there's nobody down here, although... I could. That'd be neat to have an NPC patrolling down here who's immune to water. Another gas mine. All this equipment that I'm not going to use. Uh, keep it out of my... Breath levels. I guess it's going to make it easy to get out because without a rip arrow, it would have been hard to climb out otherwise. More cheese. More loot. More legs of lamb. Sausages. Come on. Alright, let's get some air again. Uh, it's amazing how none of the NPCs ever notice how strange things are. Can I get those coins? Just. Are the dice valuable? Nope. And they don't even float. Sextant valuable? Nope. Alright, I think... Oh no, there's another door. Wow. I was gonna say that's it for loot, but there's a whole other door. Oh my god. This must be the captain's room. Captain's log of Captain Stanley the Brave. First day on the new ship. This is truly the greatest vessel in these seas, and I am the captain. This will be a wonderful journey. While the ship is terrific, I can't say the same for the crew. The first one is a woman, not a common crew member, but I'm an open-minded man. The second one is a dead guy, however. 
Wonder what good he'll be around here. Well, I guess he'll be more helpful than the third one, who is literally a talking head. Unbelievable. She prefers the company of those two imbeciles and not me. I am the captain, and yet she doesn't desire me. How can this be? Well, Captain Stanley. I'm gonna steal your treasure. If I don't run out of air first. Come on. Oh ho! Oh, well, I'm gonna have to get some more air before I can explore that. Quickly! That's close. Oh, there's another secret passage. I still don't know if some of the other items in his room here, might, in his quarters here, might be valuable. I have to check. Uh, no, ship's real. Alright. Let's see where this takes me. Let's hope it takes me somewhere quickly. Yeah. Caves! <laughs> what the hell? Someone's been living here. Wait, wait, wait. Is this the same? Oh yeah, I went up the road before. Okay. How the pirates... I suppose that's the ship? Is it a hole? No, no, just a black mark. Ah, on this side I can see the stars. I don't know what would be weirder, coming in off the street or coming in off here? Probably coming in off the street because you think, oh, this is all just, just found. And then the only weird thing is these coming up here. Whereas it's weirder, I think, to see it from above. All right. Let's get back to my shadow and see what this archer is up to. Although, yeah, I need to get back on this. This, this, the first of the two mirror images. This is the one I need to get back up on. So, while I could go through that door and get back to the opposite side, the opposite side is taking me further away from my hideout rather than closer. And uh, the hideout is the only objective left I've got. Mmm, lots of food. Look at all that food. All those moments when you, when you know, it looks like I almost mantled onto a place and then fell to my death, that's actually because Garrett's stomach was protruding too much and got in the way of his climbing because of all the damn food he's been eating. Oh, wait, I hadn't been up here yet, had I? Someone over there? Yay! That's strange. I could have sworn something was there. Yeah, very strange. All right, I'll wait till the sound just back is down, there. and then I'll go. This place must be getting to me. Hmm. Wait, was this the way I came in? Yeah, it was. Okay. Oh no, that's just the same cave again. I'm going in circles. Hello? Show yourself. I don't really want to show myself, but... If you insist, maybe. Wait, if that's the cave, then... It doesn't connect to the mirror image, does it? Oh, I don't know. I get so lost. Even when everything is the right way up, I still get lost. Right, back up here. And not in that window, but instead... I don't know, where did I come here from? Not there. Not there, because that leads to the mirror image. Uh, did I mention to get lost? I guess I, 
I don't even know if I'm trying to go east or west. Well, that's the mirror image to the west. So I must be trying to go east. So, alright, let's try that cave again then. I know I got in here. I got into the street that way. So it should take me out again. <clears throat> Although, given the way this level geometry is, I wouldn't be bidding even on that. Alright, so I'm trying to climb up the rope and the opposite. The alternative was this, which is what leads back to the pirates, right? Yes. So then this one is the way I came in. Through this weird sewer. Yeah, that's right. Ah, oh, because I was in the massive upside down place I'm jumping about. Yeah, yeah, okay. That all makes sense now. There's nothing I can uh, steal from this garden, is there? No. So I could go back in that doorway, or I could go back in the sideways room. Let's do the sideways room, because you never know. And I'll pause for some screenshots first. <laughs> Can they go in there? Oh, this is... That is my hideout, isn't it? And there's a floating, hovering, spinning scroll. Alright. Maybe this isn't over yet. Down. You. Go. Haha. <laughs> so you thought. I was standing on the wrong bit of the... Of the bed. Oh well, let's go down. At least I didn't fall down. I'm okay with climbing down. I think. Well, this is a one way trip. Uh, Alright, that's clearly a uh, cliffhanger for whatever the next episode is going to be. I'm very eager to find out, but uh, I'm going to have to look it up and, and uh, see when this was released. I think this is quite recent, so I guess I'll be a white, a white, I guess I'll be waiting a while before there's a follow-up. But uh, I really enjoyed that mission, that was a lot of fun. I was, got lost a little too much and didn't really know quite what I was doing and why. Get a thing and it doesn't do anything and see what power's up to. There's been no answers, only a lot more questions. But very fun questions along the way. I uh, missed 1100 loot, took 2 hours 40 minutes, and I missed 2 of the secrets. And alright, let's just see if there's any post mission briefing, I don't think so. Nope, so that was Cracks in the Glass. Thanks very much for watching, and I will see you here next time for the next episode, or the next mission, whatever that is. Thanks for watching.